Hello and welcome back to Digital Assets Daily. Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, wherever you are in your corner of the world. We're able to settle the SEC case, XRP lawyer draws hint. So as the Ripple vs. U.S. SEC lawsuit approaches the summary judgment, the anticipation of cracking a settlement between the parties is on the top of everyone's head. Meanwhile, the XRP holder's lawyer has cleared the air over this dispute. So John Deaton mentioned that there are people who believe that Ripple won't settle now. And Ripple CEO Brad Garlinghouse would have written the check immediately if people, SEC chair, Gary Gensler would have agreed to declare all ongoing and future sales of XRP as a non-security. He added that Ripple's not going to settle the global crypto market and can get a favorable ruling. Ripple CEO holds the duty to the firm's shareholders, but not to the crypto market. However, there is no such assurance that Ripple will do better than the judge's ruling. Meanwhile, he highlighted that the settlement will not give XRP token the regulatory clarity, but it will offer the regulatory certainty. And second, a settlement will end the litigation process, and therefore there are no appeals, and in the case of Ripple winning this summary judgment, the SEC might be filing an appeal. And you have to think back to what's going on now recently with Ripple and Brad Garlinghouse. Pretty much they're opening outside of the U.S., whereas the next current one that's being active right now the location they are designing is in Canada. So I think they're kind of prepping for either direction, either outcome, and I think they're just maxed out to the point where either the U.S. is leading from the front or they're going to where they can still be active and not miss and lose their opportunity. Continue all the delays, you know, suppose that it legitimately isn't part of the plan, then you have to sort things out and basically go into a location where there's a regulatory friendliness towards Ripple and XRP. Otherwise, they're going to miss their opportunity and someone else is going to fill that void. So I think that's basically what they're, you know, designing here and planning for is to basically, you know, remain on top and at least retain that position of authority where they already designed for Ripple software and XRP's currency to do what it's designed to do for the cross border and basically I would say then move into like derivatives etc into the enterprise the wholesale and into the financial institutions as it's designed to do. So many eyes on Ripple as legal battle with the SEC heats up and many cryptocurrency players eyes are on Ripple as its legal battles with the US securities and exchange. Uh, commission heats up stumbling over my words bear with me tonight and many other eyes will be on a former ripple advisor as he assumes a new role with the u.s federal reserve you have to think now when you hear you know an advisor to ripple working for the federal reserve you have to think back to the fed now where they were already working with and testing ripple to do exactly that for me, this is just adding to it and laying the groundwork for what is to come, what is inevitable. So Ripple producer of the XRP coin scored an important court victory on Tuesday as U.S. Magistrate Judge Sarah Netburn denied the SEC's motion to prevent one of its former officials' views on ETH, the cryptocurrency backed by the Ethereum blockchain, from being used as evidence. Also, too, XRP price might spike with Jed McCaleb's holdings about to empty as soon as tomorrow. Seems like the XRP community is on the verge of being free from the burden of Jed McCaleb, as they state, with no longer holding uh, billions and billions of XRP that gets just dumped onto the market. So that'll be interesting to see how that plays out. Me personally, I, you know, I think Jed has done amazing things with XRP and with XLM, with Stellar and Ripple. So I was always uh, admired what he had done with both of those. And I feel like you can't have one without the other. I think they're kind of like the you complete me tokens, so to speak. So we'll see how that plays out if it does affect the price. Personally, I say uh, it would be, I would be more surprised if it did affect the price than if it didn't. Let's go there. So what to expect from XRP price after Ripple's decisive win versus the SEC in the latest court filing.
So Judge Sarah Netburn denied the SEC's motion to protect Hinneman's internal notes and the emails under the attorney-client privilege. After the regulator's motion was denied, it remains to be seen whether the SEC will avoid producing the documents. Analysts believe the XRP price could rally um, if the altcoin continues uh, to rise above the 0.48 level. And guys, remember, this is not financial advice. It's for entertainment purposes only. And as always, before we go, I want to leave you with a final thought. Put your head up, he said, for you are a lion. Don't forget that, and neither will the sheep. Much love, and we will catch you in the next one.